In northern Germany, a new machine rolls across an onion field, burning away weeds with laser beams. Controlled by AI, this groundbreaking technology targets only unwanted plants. All that's left is a fine layer of ash. It heats the soil a lot, and operators need to be careful not to get burned by the laser beam. The machine delivers around 24 kilowatts of optical power with each laser at 2 kilowatts. That's enough to cause deep tissue burns within milliseconds, if, for example, you put your hand beneath it. Stefan Heinrich invented the machine. Growing up on a farm, he knew the problems weeds cause and wanted a solution. A generator at the front of the tractor powers the laser beams, while satellite navigation guides it across the field. The core innovation is the AI software Heinrich developed as part of his doctoral thesis. The camera system can distinguish between crops and weeds and control the laser beam with pinpoint accuracy. The software recognizes every stage of plant growth and stores millions of bits of information which it can retrieve again and again. The cameras are mounted underneath the housing and the software guides the laser beams to exactly where they're needed. We work outdoors where environmental conditions constantly change. Some weeds are larger, some smaller, with different leaf shapes. Adjusting all these parameters is very complex. With AI, many of them can be learned and controlled much more easily. That's why AI is a small revolution in this field. Only a handful of companies worldwide have mastered and commercialized this technology. Its development was time-consuming and costly but it's already paying off, especially for carrots and onions and in regions where labor is expensive and pesticide use is being reduced. Stefan Heinrich's partner, Thomas Stange, works in the new production hall at their company headquarters in Bavaria. The two friends and colleagues founded the company four years ago and have since developed a new type of mechanical hoeing machine. It destroys weeds between crop rows with pinpoint accuracy, also using their own AI software. The two developers started out in the workshop on their parents' farm, writing software and welding their first machines in the space where tractors are now repaired. We like building things, developing something new for farmers. You get to see more than you do as a farmer. It's more fun. You meet others, learn about their problems, and make friends who want to help even more. Many farmers struggle with a shortage of workers, especially for jobs like sorting potatoes. It's tough, dirty work that few people want to do. That's where AI software comes in. It detects rocks, clumps of soil, and rotten potatoes, and removes them faster than any person could. The machine handles 40 tons per hour, a full truckload, saving the labor of four workers. The AI software can be used in a wide range of agricultural machines. The goal now is to move toward large-scale manufacturing so more farms can benefit from this technology. No sponsors, no backing. We built all of this on our own. We're not tied to any company or group. It's just the two of us. The two developers are launching machines designed for real-world use. AI software is set to transform agricultural technology in the years ahead. For now, the system is still in its infancy.